Hey guys, what's up? Tonight I got another cooking show for you. We're gonna be cooking venison burgers. Actually, we're not doing burgers. We are cooking venison meat, and we're gonna be making tacos with it. Okay. So Cahaba, if you'll pan over here where we can see, got the meat. We're gonna cut it. We've already got the heat turned on. I think I've had it turned on for too long. So we're gonna put the meat in our pan. How much degrees do we set it for? Well, I had it on high warming up in this cast iron pan that I've got right here. And then I've turned it down to about medium since I can tell it's getting hot. And I'll put my meat in there. Is that hot? Put it all in there. Calm down, man. Calm down. Now, normally it doesn't do that, but. My cameraman and I had to get things sorted out first, so it was good and warm when we put it in. So, can you see the meat, son? Mm -hmm. Come over here where you can see it real good. Show them what we're cooking. Can you see what's going on? So, for our background audience that you can hear there, what kind of meat are we cooking? We're cooking deer meat. Okay. So, my favorite sauce or, or spice here is Tony Shackery's. Tony's the best, and my wife even likes to add this to her oranges. It says it tastes good. Oh my gosh, it's so good. She watched a guy on YouTube, and then she tried it, and then she's like, Oh, it's so good. I That's love it on my oranges. Do what? It's disrespectful. Well, I haven't tried it yet on my oranges, but I will one day. I'll let you know. You guys out there know how it turns out. So, Cobb, if you come over here real close, you can see. Can you see the meat getting brown right there? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, you So our meat, we're getting, we're, I'm sorry, I'm left-handed here. Um, so our meat's getting brown. I'm turn it back up a little bit. Turn it down too much. And it's cooking, and you can see it's nice and moist in there. It's not drying out. See, what you want is, you want the meat to get all of it brown, and then it's probably ready. Yeah, all, when, once all the meat is brown, you don't want to leave any uncooked. Um, once all of it's brown, it's not like cooking a steak, then you are ready and good to go. And when we get to that point, I'll show you guys how we do the tacos, okay? Is this deer meat? Yes, sweet, sweetheart, it's deer meat for the 13th time. So, and I usually put a little Dell seasoning on here too, just for a little bit of flavor and moisture. There we go. And it is Yummer Doodles, for sure. All right, guys. So I'm gonna keep stirring here. I'm not gonna keep you. And when we're done, we'll come back and we'll show you how we set up the tacos for dinner, okay? All right, peace out. Hey guys, what's up? So we're about finished here. I've turned the oven off and you guys can look. Kahaba, can you come in real close here? So we can see we got all of our meat cooked. There's no red left and it's nice and moist. It's gonna be super yummy for our tacos. And what we don't eat today, we have some tacos tomorrow. So. It's really good and really yummy. And you can see right here, these are our accoutrement. So you can add this kind of cheese, which Cahaba likes, or you can add this kind, which I'm gonna use. Um, and then we like to use these little mini tortillas and make mini little- I like the um, hard ones. You like the hard shell, I like the soft shell. So um, we got some hard shell if you wanna get one out. But that's all there is to it. And I'll just take some pictures of the finished product. You guys take care. Hey guys, what's up? Yeah, I don't know how you toast your tortillas, but this is how we toast ours. Shh. You hear that sizzle? Mmm. Now you can't leave it on there too long or it gets stuck. Give it a few more seconds. See that warm fire behind it? Oh, snap, 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 snap. Oh, it smells delicious. And it looks kind of like a face. Mm. Y'all gonna have a good day.